Welcome to DGU Tutorials. DGLUX is a drag and drop visualization platform which enables you to design real time data driven applications and dashboards. DGLUX is a client side Flash based application which runs in any Flash enabled browser. This being said, we also have native mobile applications for iOS and Android which allows you to access your DGLUX views on any mobile device such as iPhones, iPads, Android phones and tablets, or Blackberry Playbook. Now that you understand the value of DGLUX and how it operates, let me show you some of the navigation within the system. The first thing that you are going to notice is the navigational tabs on top. Each tab gives you a hierarchical tree of your saved dashboards on the left hand side. To open a dashboard, simply double click on it and it will appear on the main stage. This navigation can be created for any user or user group. You can also copy the URL link by clicking and holding on the tab, then pasting it into a new browser window. This has several benefits, one being that it is an ideal solution for kiosks and touch screen interfaces. For example, Say you have a customer who is looking to be LEED certified and needs to showcase his energy efficiencies on an LCD panel. In this scenario, DGLUX is the perfect solution. Another way that you can navigate is within the actual dashboard itself. In this example, if you roll over any floor, a blue highlight will appear acting as a button of navigation. This type of navigation can be built with behaviors to any symbol, image, or created object. This functionality is commonly known as the drill down feature. It is frequently used on dashboards like the central plant overview where you can drill down into any specific piece of machinery's performance. This allows the user to dive as deep as they want to into any form of data allowing for a fully immersive user experience. Now that you know the basic navigation of DGLUX, let's go over some of the other functionality available within the view mode of the application. The green play button is kiosk mode. This allows you to automatically cycle the predefined dashboards or images in full screen which is ideal for standalone kiosks. You can also adjust the timer here with the delay slider. The green cube allows you to switch back and forth in and out of design mode, which is only visible for administrative users. Under the user icon, you can log out, check the status of your license or make adjustments to your license. You can check for DGLUX software updates, access the navigation builder, as well as user management. Under the star menu, there is an option which allows you to submit feedback. This feedback mechanism, which is built right into DGLUX, is your direct connection to the DGLogic support team where you can ask questions, request a feature, or submit a bug. When you submit, the intelligent feedback will include everything that our team needs to answer your question, add your feature, or resolve your issue. There is annotation mode, which is an excellent collaboration tool. This allows you to create markups, add text, and highlights right on top of your views to point something out to other DGLUX users. There is also a global date range setting. This will adjust the date range for every single widget within your view. Lastly, you have multiple options for reporting. You can export any view as a PDF document, an Excel spreadsheet, or an image, allowing you to create custom reports or even tenant billing statements. After this quick introduction, you should be able to navigate your way around DGLUX. Thank you for tuning in to DGU Tutorials. We'll see you next time.